Hello everyone, today as you have seen on the screen, new pair of socks, new pattern, and this is a new free pattern for you guys. This is my second, I think this is my second free pattern this year, sock pattern. And uh, this is because this year there are a few milestone celebrations in regards to my romantic relationship and about my job. So uh, that's that. More about, I know you're probably not interested about that, but if you are and you want to see behind the scene how I manage to do things and knit and design and go to work and do the gardening, I recommend you to go and check join button that is a monthly subscription to receive extra perks and one of those perks are vlogs so I'm, I'm trying to get snips of here and there but also there are coupon codes uh, for my individual patterns on Reverly and also monthly giveaways so check it out all the links down below straight away I'm going to tell you that this pattern is it is a free knitting pattern. It is a toe-up sock with afterthought heel. The afterthought heel is the one that you knit the two pairs, mark sides of the sock and then you cut the yarn later on. No worries, the pattern has links to tutorials so I will guide you through it and then you're reaching to this beautiful section. It is chotted and then you finish your ribbing and tubular bind off. However, there's suggestions that you can do a different bind off in the pattern too. Aren't they cute hearts? This is a fingering weight sock. The sample is for 56 stitches and that reminds you to tell you that there are four sizes. Check the screen now. 48, 56, 64 and 72 stitches. So if you've knitted socks before you probably know which number is for you with the yarn you like to knit. And I knit them on US size 1 which is 2.25 millimeter needle needles get engaged 32 stitches by 40 rounds however to knit these and if I hold maybe a fingering double or I would have DK weight yarn I would go for size 1 but I would change knitting needles to US size 2 which is 2.75 millimeter needles and that way it will knit up quicker to achieve the same size but in different weight yarn. It was so much fun, knit, so easy, so relaxing and and definitely stay tuned for next video because there will be actual sock for giveaway for my subscribers. Tempted? Subscribe, hit that bell but check those bells because I know people are telling me that I don't see my videos so FYI so check it out so you're not going to miss it. And second of all, in regards to that, because I hear a few things, I think the best thing to do is to make some action. If you just watch and you don't do anything, I think the YouTube thinks that you just ignore the video. So if you write something down below, like at least two words, because other one, sometimes one word is not enough. <laughs> at least two words or hit the thumbs up um, that will tell YouTube that you want more content like that. And that's fun because my mom told me to tell you that my mom. Anyway, let me show you the yarn that I used because you're probably interested to see. So my base yarn that I use is this one and this is the yarn that I got from Knitgrade. They send in boxes my way for free and um, they don't tell me what to do with the yarn. I could give it away but I love really knitting with it so sorry not sorry. And this is Audin Wool's Cloud Sock I think is the one. I need to check April 20... April 21st. And this is 60% superwash merino, 30% mohair, 10% nylon. And it's such, and it's honey moon. So I still have over here 60 grams of yarn. So I used 40. In my pattern, my color work patterns, I'll show you the sock that I knitted. And I tell you how much yarn I used for that size. Obviously, if you want longer here, you would need a little bit more. If you want longer here, you would need a little bit more. And so on and so on. The brown color, I don't have it because I'm, I think, using it now. That was Knit Picks, Heather, I think. And the hearts, if you're interested in this, it's not really red, it's not really 
pink fuchsia no tell me what color is it i'm just there's a specific name for it west yorkshire spinners signature ply this is zero six it is beautiful i love this i really like this red or pink so that's that hopefully i'm right with hopefully i'm right with the yarn and the naming of it now i'm going to put lightning down below and i have patterns on three three platforms so far anyway uh, it is Raverly, it is lovecraft and it is etsy uh, i will not have this pattern on etsy because etsy is a platform to sell things and they're charged for placing an item for a period of time and they and then ask you to renew it so that extra cost for me no no therefore you can find it on Ravelry, lovecrafts okay let me know now to who you would want to knit these socks to remember if you're not a knitter but you still like it stay tuned for my next video when i'll be when i will be giving a pair of socks away and uh, yeah i would want to hear to who or you will or you did knit this pattern for i hope you enjoyed this one see you next one bye